Right, this is my homemade massaging washer, commonly known as DIY Bathing Beauty. It's a normal submersible pump. Hopefully you can all see these details here. And it's plugged into a normal three pin plug. This is a normal washing machine hose that's been fitted onto the outlet pipe with a Jubilee clip available at any DIY shop. All you simply need to do with this is place it in your bath, put a plug in your bath. This is the kill switch. When you do that, it comes on. When you drop it, it comes off. if I turn it on. Right, quantities of water. I'm doing it this way just to show the minimum amount of water required. Two litres. It's approximately six litres of water. In fact, I would say it's about five, if five, so I'm just going to pop that up to there. You then lift that and place it on the side of your bar. You then place the amount of shampoo that you require. This is already diluted down to 16 to 1, which this protect particular shampoo is diluted down to. Always shake the shampoo. That's the amount I'm going to use at the start. And just again, it's around about two teaspoonfuls diluted down. Some of these DIY bathing beauties need to be primed. The easiest way to prime it, just put a little bit of water in the pump, lift up, it should start going. Just because this is a video. There we go. And you can see, even with that diluted down 16 to 1, just the two tablespoons, uh, teaspoons of water, it's more than enough bubbles. You can change the flow when you're bathing the dog by just simply squeezing the end last the hair and get rid of knots and tangles. Also, once you've gone over the whole dog with this, part, this one lot of shampoo, because of the way dirt works and shampoo works, the shampoo, well actually, if that is the dirt, the shampoo does that and traps the dirt in like a shell of shampoo. So you can in fact bath the dog all over once, then add your second shampoo to the water, bath the dog in the same water, and the dog will get become clean. Even tiny dogs you can bath with this. They don't mind it, in fact they enjoy it. When you come to finish, simply drop that down, move it over, let the plug out, turn the shower to cold, 
Okay, it's not going to rinse away as fast as I would like it because obviously the shampoo hasn't got any dirt traps in it which makes it collapse even further and quicker. You can either wash the suds away with cold water or as you are rinsing the dog off the shampoo will degrade and break down and flow away. You can also use um, organic washing softener that is a natural safe one and it breaks down. And that is how simple it is to use to actually clean it out after you've bathed the dog you simply again flush through the system with water and at the end of the day I do this with vinegar vinegar and water mix just to ensure that the whole thing is clean this pump I think costs me about 40, 40 pounds and I bought it about four years ago now and it's been in daily use ever since. It stores up there so that you drain into the bath. Always dry your hands before turning the plugs off. And there we go, homemade bathing beauty. Hope that helps everyone.